Hi, good afternoon. Welcome back. Thanks for watching Military and Family Matters with the Pickets. Right, so today's conversation is going to be about military budgeting and tips to managing finances while serving. Nobody is immune to finances. We all have inherent struggles while we're serving in the military. And for individuals who are not even in the military, finance is the center focal point in all of our decisions that we make on a, on a day to day basis. Right. So I'm just going to go to a brief overview and give you a step by step guide of how we conduct our finances, how we manage our military budget. And maybe you can have take away some tips and some key takeaways for you and your family. Right. So, number one, understanding your income. Right. Breaking down the military component pay. Right. You, you could be getting BAH. You could be getting BAS. You could be getting BAH diff, family separation allowance. Special duty pay, jump pay. You should most importantly calculate all of these sums of money up for your monthly income, right? Because all, although it could fluctuate, but understanding when it starts to fluctuate, that's how you a good way to start to manage your bu budget, right? Tracking expenses, right? So it's important. It's important to track all expenses. We got expenses that are that are fixed, right? It could be rent, mortgage utilities and a lot of things variable car payments insurance all of these expenses are fixed and track groceries and nowadays right creating a monthly bet creating a monthly budget would be next right setting financial goals short term and long term allocating funds for for necessities right necessary items such as food transportation and housing incorporating spending habits right Maybe you want to do entertainment. Maybe you want you got some hobbies. I know for us, we kind of like we we have a lot of entertainment expenses because we got to disconnect from regular routines of work. Right. Managing debt. Now, this is a critical one. Now, when it comes to managing debt, understanding the common source of debt for military members. Right. Credit cards and loans. Common source credit cards and loan. Strategies have a strategy for paying off debt, right? Using a debt snowball versus the debt avalanche, right? Utilizing the benefits of Service Member Civil Relief Act, right? SCRA for managing interest rates, right? On debt while you're in the military. All of these are critical factors that are good to use. Next would be building an emergency fund. The importance of an emergency fund can be overstated, right? Tips for setting aside portions of money. It's, kind of, it's critical, especially in today's economic climate when a, too much uncertainty is right in front of you, right? Savings and investing, right? Not too many individuals tend to save and not too many people tend to invest. If you're in a TSP, you're doing passive investing, which is great, right? Saving 10, 15, 100, 200, $300 per paycheck, if you can, goes a long way at the end of a year, right? Oh. Understanding the overview of your thrift savings plan, right? Still under savings, how to maximize benefits and the importance of long-term savings and investing for retirement later on. Make sure all these things are tied into your family goals. Utilizing military benefits, right? It's a detailed overlook of benefits that can help you save money, right? So utilizing your GI Bill, don't take out student loans. Utilize the GI Bill for education. Utilize VA home loan um, the, the, utilize the VA home loan benefit, right? Understand your military discounts and use them, right? These are good perks for you to save some money. Adjusting your budget for PCS and deployments, right? Special considerations should be in your budget when you're getting ready to PCS and you're going on a deployment, right? Understanding DLA, TLA, TLE, right? Um, also, setting up automatic payments, right, to manage additional deployment income. I don't like setting up automatic payments because one, I like to pay my own bills. It holds me accountable, but I know Hadia likes to set up automatic payments and I hate to see the unknown with draft that comes out every single month, but we have to find a balance in the middle in which we have where we manage our money. We manage every single dollar and we know how every single dollar works for us, right? I hope you learned some today because this is how we manage our budget, right, for the entire year. We kind of like sit back and do an overview and see what we have coming in. We see what's going out and we also categorize our, our investment, our savings, our finances, 
our everyday expenses and we put it all to one pot, right? And then we try to divvy it out, right? Oh, I hope you learned something good and talk to your spouse. This is this is a call to action, right? Have that conversation, have those tough conversations and set your family up for success, right? Because nobody, nobody can manage the budget by themselves, right? Well, technically you can, but it's better to manage that budget with a willing partner who wants to support you. All right, thanks for watching. Stay tuned and thank you for watching Military and Family Manners, right? Manage that budget. Use all the resources out there. First Command is there for you. Most importantly, you are in charge of the money that you spend and you save.